Okay, do they know something that we don't know? I'm Ty Smith, Model Renaissance Man. Welcome to my channel, Model Renaissance Man. If you are someone that's been subscribed to my channel for a long time, double check to make sure that you are. But if you are fairly new to the channel, get an idea of what this channel is about. What do you do? Go to my channel, click on playlist, all these different things I do on this channel. See all these different thumbnails? Those are all different categories of things that I do on this channel from comedy to cooking to DIY when it comes to fixing cars. There's a lot of things I do on this channel. So check the channel out in its entirety before you subscribe. I'm pretty sure you'll find something on here that you like. What's going on folks? Appreciate you guys all being here. Make sure you do everything I told you to do at the beginning of this video. Follow me on all these platforms you see listed up here and all there. I'm also on another YouTube channel called Man, Husband, Father and another YouTube channel that's incognito called Meme Stream Media Shorts, <clears throat> where I post shorts. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So Sticky Icky Nicky still is trying to hang in there and I don't know why, but it makes you think. Do I need to go find out what it is that I do not know? Because why would she be hanging in there? Why would she be hanging in there? And Democrats are encouraging her to stay in there. And a lot of Democrat sources are funding her as well. It makes you think what's going on, what they got up their sleeve. You know what I mean? Because I think a lot of us are so focused on we now. Here's my deal, ladies and gentlemen. We know that Trump is going to win the primary or do we? <laughs> no, we know that Trump is going to win the primary or the GOP. But are we so focused on that that we're not trying to look and see what it is that they're over here doing? Anyway, let me get ready to get into this. Before I do, make sure you hit the like button, ladies and gentlemen. Appreciate you if you do that. Trump defeats Haley in Missouri Republican caucuses. Of course, we knew that Missouri is a red state. I have residents there, and I love it. I love their, I wish every, I wish Illinois, can y'all do what Missouri is doing? You know, you can just carry, conceal, don't got to worry about getting no permit and nothing like that. Anyway. Haley has vowed to remain in the race. You guys are like, Ty, what are you talking about? What are you looking at? I'm looking at this right here. I'll show you in a minute. She vowed to stay in the race, but I want to know what for. I wish she would tell us for what for. Donald Trump will, Donald Trump will win the Republican caucuses. The Associated Press projects delivering yet another victory for the former president against former UN ambassador Nikki Haley. The Associated Press called the race for Trump early Saturday afternoon. The former president was expected to cruise to victory after big wins in every contest prior to Saturday. After her loss in her home state of South Carolina, Haley vowed to remain in the race at least through Super Tuesday on March the 5th, where voters in 15 states will head to the polls to make their choice for president. Hopefully we're able to do that live, y'all. Make sure y'all keep an uh. Make sure y'all keep up with me and all that because uh, YouTube on, uh, most likely is not going to show you guys that I am posting and most likely going to be shooting that live on Super Tuesday for those 15 states that I think Nikki Haley is going to lose all of them. Even though Trump is the clear winner of the state of Missouri, of the state, Missouri awards 51 of its 54 delegates through a months long process called a caucus convention system that only begins with Saturday's caucus caucusing. The system dictates that 11 delegates will be awarded to candidates at the state level and will and five will be awarded each of Missouri's eight congressional districts. The three remaining delegates are the chairman of the Missouri Republican Party and its national committee men and committee woman who can support any candidate they wish, regardless of the caucus results. A candidate that wins the support of more than 50 percent of the vote at a particular caucus site wins all the delegates at stake at that caucus. The delegates are awarded proportionately. If not, candidate clears the 50% threshold. Democrats will hold their primary in Missouri on March 23rd, which we most likely know that is most likely going to be Joe Biden. All right. So with that being said, for those of you that follow a lot of things closely, you might know some inside information that I don't know. What is she doing? Why is she standing here? I know people... There are a lot of different things out there saying that Nikki Haley is like the Trojan horse or whatever like that. But I want to just say this because I love Greek mythology and things like that. If Nikki Haley is the Trojan horse, wouldn't that be like a contradiction? Because a Trojan horse was something that they didn't see coming. You know what I'm saying? Walls opened up. They got inside with the Trojan horse, thought it was a gift. Or are y'all saying Nikki Haley is a Trojan horse? And once, if this, no, I don't think it's going to happen. Should Donald Trump lose? 
go to jail, be in prison, which there's no law to say he can't be president from prison. Anyway, should Donald Trump get incarcerated, then Nikki Haley is going to be the Trojan horse of the GOP party. And once she get in there, everything inside the Trojan horse is all Democratic stuff. I mean, she already been ousted pretty much as a globalist. She's all for war, things of the sort. And as of late, I don't know if y'all know this. It's been put out that a Nikki Haley had an affair on her husband while he was over serving. That might be something we're going to hit on a little later because all I told, all I'm saying as far as this, if they are going to play these games, Trump is a traitor. He had affairs. Trump did this. He did that. Now you, if she did this, I am definitely going to be on this. I'm not saying she did. I'm not saying she didn't. I'm saying right now there's things that's been coming out, rumored, et cetera, et cetera, that's been saying that Nikki Haley had an affair on her husband while he was over there serving. That'll be definitely something interesting to get into if that is true. If any of you know about that, make sure y'all leave it in the comment section about this so-called rumor that's going around about Miss Sticky Icky Nicky. But to sum this up, ladies and gentlemen, we all knew, we all knew it. There was not going to be no competition. There was not going to be, I'm staying in it because one thing I know don't mess with the women. <laughs> woo, ladies, yeah, woo. And not only that, that's a brown woman, too. <laughs> Let, me stop. Let me stop. Anyway, y'all, I just wanted to give y'all this quick little update. I wanted to know what y'all thoughts is on this. For one, okay, tell me this. Why do you guys think she's staying in here? Do you think Trump is really going to go to jail? Do y'all know about the Supreme Court ruling? In regards to the January 6th people possibly being let out. Do y'all know about that? Also, also, do you think that on Super Tuesday that Nikki Haley is going to win any state? Let me know in the comments below after this video. If you're trying to figure out what did you say again, Ty, just rewind, rewind it a little bit and you'll hear me repeat the same thing. Make sure you guys get into those cell phones. Let one person know about this channel. You guys are doing an awesome job in this. Again, you know I'm going to ask you that. If you have let every person in your cell phone know that have the same mindset that you do and I do, same principles, standing on God, family, country, if you let all them in your cell phone know about that, that would be absolutely 100% awesome. But I only ask you for one every time I do a video. Anyway, I'm willing to see what you guys, well, I'm willing, I'm uh, anxious to see what you guys going to put in the comment section regarding why Nikki Haley's still in there? Is Donald Trump going to jail? Supreme Court letting the January Sixers out? Supposedly, it's supposed to be something that's coming, et cetera, et cetera. Let me know, folks, in the comment section, all right? Let's move on to the next one. I am Ty Smith, model Renaissance man, hoping and praying that every last one of you have food, shelter, and clothing. And most of all, I pray every last one of you guys are in great health mentally, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. God bless you all through Jesus.